Hey guys, it's your boy Swift Pogs here and welcome back to my channel and today I'll be talking about five things that pops in my mind when I think of gay culture. So stay tuned and watch my shit, bitch. So, before we start this video guys, I'll give you guys the definition of culture. Culture is the idea, customs, and social behavior of a particular group of people. Got that? Okay, let's start this video. Okay, first thing on my list would be acceptance. Cause I feel as if we all experience moments in our lives where we felt unwelcome and unaccepted. So amongst ourselves, we feel free and liberated and we can do whatever we wanna do in this community as one. So I would definitely say my number one would be acceptance. And number two, will most definitely be 1000% hands down Britney Spears toxic. Yep, I said it, Britney Spears toxic. We all had that one hit and that's Britney Spears, I think. Like all of my friends and I, we all think Britney Spears toxic was a big thing in the gay community. Like that song, that, that video did so much shit to us. Like we would enjoy every single night playing toxic and you'll feel yourself get lost in the moment. So, number two on my list is definitely Britney Spears Toxic. So, next on my list would have to be this new generation of guys that I've noticed that are on dating apps having prep for breakfast and thinking that they're now immune to all sexual ailments, which is quite silly and whack. Like, you think because you take prep in the morning that you're now immune to all sexual infections. No, you're not. Prep is to help prevent the cause of HIV. Got that? The cause of HIV to prevent you from having chlamydia and all these dumb whack shit outside there. So educate yourselves and be safe guys. And let's move forward from here. Next on my list is something that I think everyone can relate to. Is that not being able to scroll through their phones in public. Like I can't go on Instagram and not see a naked man like prancing around or working out or something and it's quite embarrassing on the bus or on the train like sitting there and someone behind you is sneaking over looking at your phone and you're like oh that guy's defo gay like i don't really mind people know that i'm gay but it's a bit cringy seeing like soft porn in public i think so that's my next thing on my list so this is the end of my video so thank you guys for watching and i'll appreciate if you guys hit subscribe and like my video and before you guys go could you guys go down below in my comment section and leave five things that pops to your mind when you think of gay culture and i'll be there as well commenting and talking to you guys so thank you very much till next time watch my shit bitch <laughs>